Ashley's Cosplay here. Long time no see. I haven't had the chance to do content for YouTube because a lot of my content tends to be cosplay builds, which I haven't really felt like doing lately, or con vlogs, which I can't attend because of COVID. So yes, it's been a little bit of a dry spell. However, I did come across something that I think a lot of you will enjoy. I know I'm going to enjoy it. I'm just gonna cut to the chase. I am going to be reviewing the Mia Stores wig storage bag. They went viral a little bit on Twitter among cosplayers and uh, sold out within like a day after the tweet went viral. And after that, I went ahead and pre-ordered not one, not two, but three bags because let's face it, I knew I was gonna love it because it's so different. So. Join me. My wig storage bags came in this black bag. I censored out my address. <laughs> and I already pre-opened it. They're a little heavy and I think that's because of the hangers themselves. Oh, okay, let's do this. There we go. It came with this lovely insert. And uh, I think it's got a discount on it, so that's nice. Because you know I'm going to be buying a lot of these. So here's what the bag looks like. It's pretty long. Looks really nice. Now that I have my big bags, let me show you what I had for storage for my long wigs. My short wigs are on these wig heads, which is fine, but long wigs, terrible on wig heads because they just get all tangled and everything. So I have these, just lots and lots of Ziploc bags. Not great. Some of these actually don't look too bad, but I don't like keeping them in here. I would rather this little cubby be used for something else. So, we bags. They look kind of, now that I look at this, it looks kind of like a garment bag, but tiny. It's a tiny little garment bag, but for your wigs. Oh, I love it. Okay, so. We unzip it, and then get the hanger out. Come on, buddy. There we go. This is, I have the same issue with garment bags, so that's user error. Okay. Oh, it's got, it's got their logo on the hanger too. I love it. Okay, so. I believe we open it by, yeah, there we go. It's one of these kinds of hangers. So I'm going to test it with this wig. This wig has been, oh, look at it. It's so sad. Look at how tangled and everything it is. My poor thing. This is an Arda wig in Raven, I believe. It's got like, it's got like blue fibers and stuff. I love it. Anyway, I use this for my Diane Wynn cosplay for Bojack Horseman. And it still has a bobby pin in here. Oh my god. A mess. Anyway, long story short, it's a mess. Um, I'm sure you're sh it would be best practice to untangle this first before storing it. But for the purpose of keeping this video short, we're not going to do that. Instead, we're just going to hang it. So, me being me, I honestly don't know what best practice is as far as hang- like, do I just hang it maybe this way? I'm not gonna lie, some instructions would probably help because I am a noob when it comes to wig care management and storage, so I don't know quite the best 
way to go off. Is this right? I don't know. Just shove it in there and then lock it shut. Oh, it worked! Hey! Okay, this would look a lot nicer if it wasn't such a tangly mess of a wig. But it definitely stays. Yeah, I guess you don't really need instructions. But I guess I'm also the paranoid type that's like, am I doing this 100% proper? Is this the proper way to store things? Anyway, okay. So now that it's there, now we wrangle this mess back into our wig hanger bag. I don't know why I'm like nervous. I think it's because I'm recording this, so it's like I look like an idiot trying to do this. Also, I'm gonna turn this because that's a preference. So I'm gonna get the wig part. Sorry, the hanger part in first, and then we'll worry about the wig. Okay. Be helpful if I could hang this right now. Well, I could just set it down. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I'll put it on my spool thingy. So we just do that and then we kind of tuck it in a little bit. The wig's just a little bit longer than the bag, but I think that's okay. Again, if this were the proper way, this wouldn't be such a tangled mess and it would look a lot nicer. Watch me like forget to detangle this and then I take it out of storage ready to wear it and like it's a mess because I didn't take the time to actually <laughs> comb it now. Whatever. I'll, that's that's future Ashley's problem. That's awesome. You can, <laughs> The wig itself blends in really <laughs> like with the bags to the point that you can't even see it because the bag is black and the wig is practically black like it's blue but like let's be real it's practically black it has to be in like direct sunlight for it to look blue so like this bag looks empty so maybe this wasn't even a great example to use but that's okay i like it I... the material is so like silky smooth for the bag itself And like, I mean, it obviously works as intended. So that's, oh wait, we have to do another test. Hold on. All right, so now I have my wig in here. Again, you can barely see it. It like blends in with the bag. I, I promise, it's, you watched me do it. It's in there. <laughs> now I can put it in storage. Oh my God, it's the perfect blade. <laughs> If it was any longer, it would it would hit the filing cabinet. That's nice. I like it. I'm glad I got three, because I'm going to need it. I will give it a 9 out of 10. I only took away one point because I'm a little dumb. I need instructions. So just a set of easy to read instructions for like where specifically on the wig to clamp the hanger would be great. Everything else is self-explanatory because it's, again, it's like a mini gun bag. So I, I really like it. I'm glad I got it. I would highly recommend. I will put the link in the description and I'm gonna be posting this. I'm gonna be blasting this everywhere because like cosplayers need to know. So that's the Mia store. You should absolutely check them out. I really like these. And I'm absolutely, once I'm done recording, putting the rest of my wigs in them. And by rest of the wigs, I mean one per bag. I do not have enough of these to put all my wigs in. This is a really elegant solution. I love that you can hang them because I don't want to have to use up a valuable cubby space that should be used for cosplay supplies I don't want to use it up on wigs. And this is perfect because I have a decent amount of hanging space. Yeah, I really like it. And I think you should check them out. Hey, wait. One more thing. So, I don't know if you noticed, I'm wearing a cosplay shirt. And guess what? I designed it! 
So yeah, I'm a graphic designer by day, cosplayer by night, and weekend, or whatever. But lately I haven't gotten to cosplay. So I've been using t-shirt design as a creative outlet and I've been really enjoying it. So all of my t-shirts are cosplay themed. So there's this one and there's like a bunch of different other designs that I have available. Huh? Huh? And you can check them out at my store, ashmiscosplay.com slash shop. That's all I've got. Thanks for watching. Bye! See you next time.